guys, Katrina here, this ever really. Welcome back to my channel. Well, today I'm going to take a trip down to uh, the slip road where the Titanic was built because I know quite a few of you from the States had to cancel your trip because of the pandemic. So, would you like to join me? There is also a museum there, which is uh, Titanic Belfast, which was voted to be the, the world's best tourist attraction a few years ago. I don't know whether it still is now, but fortunately it's closed due to the pandemic. And I do plan to do a walkthrough or roll through, given that I'm in the wheelchair, uh, once it opens again. The museum features more on the engineering that went into building the, the ship and the history of our city rather than the tragedy of the sinking of the Titanic. I have been before and it's really quite a, a good museum. This is the SS Nomadic. The SS Nomadic is the last remaining White Star Liner uh, in existence. This was used as a tender for ships like the Titanic if they couldn't get into port. Uh, at the minute she's being used as a restaurant. She's also being restored, which is why she's in the dry dock at the minute. As you can see, there's no water. Uh, again, she's closed because of the pandemic, but once she's open, I will uh, take a visit there too. She worked out of uh, Cherbourg and she was spent quite a while over in France as, as a floating restaurant. But she was brought over here quite a few years ago and restored to what she's uh, as now. But uh, she still has to be restored some more. These are the slip roads where the Titanic and her sister ship Olympic were built. Olympic was this one on the right, and Titanic was on the left. These pillars here represent the gantry cranes that were used to build both the Olympic and the Titanic. Uh, as you can see, they're no longer standing. This uh, slip road is no longer in use. The shipyard that built the Titanic is still a functioning shipyard. Although they've been in quite a bit of financial uh, trouble recently. I believe they don't build ships anymore. I think they fix uh, oil rigs and uh, such a thing such as um, those uh, wind turbines that uh, are offshore. Uh, they don't use gantry cranes as they did back in Titanic's day. Uh, they have a different type of gantry crane. Uh, this is one of them. Uh, there are two, uh, Samson and Delilah. I believe uh, Samson is the bigger one. I don't know which one this one is. but There were three Olympic class liners. The Olympic was the only one to make it through to the end of its life. We all know what happened to the Titanic, but uh, the other ship, the Britannic, was used as a hospital ship during World War I, and she was sunk on the 21st of November 1916 in the Aegean Sea, uh, killing about 26 people. Uh, the wreck is still there, although you can go down and dive to it, unlike the Titanic. This is an example of the, the steel that was used to build the, both the Titanic and the Olympic. Um, as you can see, this plate has been stamped to SS-401, which was Titanic's hull number when she was here in Belfast. That was before she was named. Both ships would have been propped up with pieces of wood like this um, metal sheet is resting on and when they were ready to launch they would have removed the ones from the back or the, the stern of the ship and then she would have slid into the water. At the time that she was built the Titanic was the biggest ship in the world. Of course there are much bigger ships in existence today. I think the biggest one in, uh, today is uh, an oil tanker. The bow or the front of the ship would have been here and the stern or back of the ship would have been all the way down here. If you see the last brown posts at the very end where the, the gantry cranes were, that's where the, the back of Titanic would have been. Thank you for watching. If you liked the video, please like, comment and subscribe by clicking below. And remember to hit the notification bell as YouTube does not notify you when I upload a video unless you hit the notification bell. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.